nouveau épisode My friend is a cook My friend is a cook This is C. Today we are breaking to Huyen's house and preparing her and Joanne some Chinese dishes. Mm. The dish I'm going to cook today are Tang Tzu Pai Gu and Ma Po Dong. <laughs> and I will do the Jia Jiang Mian. I don't know how to say that in English, so Jia Jiang Mian in Chinese. I'm going to cook the meat now. The first thing you do is to heat your pot. And then put some oil in it because it's the pork meat, so it has some of the fat and oil already. So you don't have to put like that much. So only just a bit. And when it has sparkles on the oil, so we put the ginger in. Well, the ginger is most for to remove the smell of the pork because someone don't like. The actual smell for the pork so the ginger can reduce it to have a better taste for the dish so we put the ginger in it first you have to make the rib already well cooked and then we add vinegar, sugar and soy sauce we use two different types of soy sauce, the dark one and the normal one. The normal one is for the flavor, but the dark one is to color our dishes, to make it look more delicious. To the bread become already like gold on the outside, with the normal soy sauce to have the salty taste, and then vinegar, dark soy sauce to add the color for our dishes. When the color is even, we'll add the water all over the rib. After we put the water in it, we just wait for it to be steaming and make, wait for the sauce to be caramelized. And during this process, you have to keep stirring it evenly, just in case all the meat stay in the bottom of the pot. And after that, our dishes is done. Why you choose to um, to do this dish? Um, it's like the first like signature Chinese dish I have ever learned. After I I came to France and I start to learn this dish because it's super easy. <laughs> and uh, when I like mastered it, I cooked a lot to my friends and they all loved it. So I decided to bring this dish to Huyen. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hello, Celine. Hi. What are you doing? I'm cutting all the vegetables. It's okay. it's um part of preparation for my noodles. Jia jiang mian in Chinese and in English. Sorry about that. I don't know how to say that in English and in French. <laughs> for the preparation of jia jiang mian, we need cucumber, carrot, some eggs, and um brown beans like this. You can find it easily in the um, Asian market and then the sauce the most important thing is sweet bean paste like this yeah the spirit of noodles and this one yeah the thick noodles so it has to like be this. thick yeah it's better it's more traditional okay yeah. but if we use the thin one well actually it doesn't matter but maybe Taste is not really delicious with that one. I choose this jia jiang mian, this dish for my friends, because I think the spirit of this noodles it's the sauce and the fat, really. <laughs> because I add uh, some pork inside with the sauce, and when we mix the sauce and meat and noodles together and some vegetables, yeah, interesting and delicious. This jia jiang mian, this noodles, it's, well, the easiest one among the Chinese dishes. It's really easy. So you just have to try this weekend, maybe. What I'm going to do is add some water into the eggs. 
The eggs were gonna um, more juicy and more tasteful. Only the carrots need to be boiled because it's hard. What is that? This one is the sauce for the jiajiang mian. Uh huh. So we <laughs> we almost finished. Yeah. Soon we can eat. Yeah. I'm so hungry.